Ready? Mm -hmm. Hey guys, so I have arrived at the Laser Away facility and they have sponsored this video, this nice vlog. So this is the life of an influencer. Um, if you network or you actually are serious about this, you know, job basically or lifestyle, you get perks, okay? You get sponsorships and this is one of them. So I'm getting a series of six treatments. I chose to do... Um, laser skincare treatments instead of like laser hair removal and cool sculpting and of course not Botox not for me but they do Botox honey for the, for the ladies um, but in the next few series which will be the next six months I'll be doing cool sculpting so anyway they have like really notable clients like the Kardashians so I'm really excited to to be working with them actually and to be utilizing their services and I'm excited to see if it works on dark skin especially with old scars acne scars and uh, blemishes and everything so i'm gonna take you guys with me on this little journey like i said about branding and sponsorships and stuff it's really about what you put on your page if you have skincare videos skincare companies going to reach out to you and not only skincare companies but skin treatment facilities you know if you if you do cooking cooking uh types of uh cookware stuff like that they're going to reach out to you so make sure you guys sign up or watch watch out for my upcoming video um, I'm going to talk about that in detail about YouTube and branding and sponsorships and how these things work. And I'm going to hook you up with some of the, um, actual like client, well, the, the names of these brands that reach, reach out and yeah, we'll get into detail. And so I'm really excited to have partnered with laser away to bring you guys this vlog. I'm going to do some shopping in the city. <clears throat> I'm going to go to some luxury stores and some very affordable. Cause you guys know there's a, always supposed to be a balance. Don't just spend up all your money on high-end stuff, honey, that has no value in the end. You're not going to take this stuff to hell with you. I'm just playing. Because <laughs> some of y'all might be going for real. But anyway, you can't take it to heaven with you. So, yeah, you might as well save a coin while you can, while you're still living. So, I'm going to go to Nordstrom, Neiman Marcus, Sugar Factory, TJ Maxx, and maybe a couple other stores. But I definitely have to go to Nordstrom. I need to get some shoes from there. Um, and the baccarat so i do need to go to neiman's i need to go to neiman marcus because i think Saks will be too packed but i don't know so if you're interested in my journey to clear glass skin girl stay tuned so here we are at laser away town chicago do halloween The staff is so nice. And it's cutely decorated. Cutely. I made that word up. Y'all know. And the products and everything. I love this. I like how you guys have it decorated. It is so cute. And perfectly pink for the month thing. Yeah. Definitely got my mammogram. So I'm good to go. <laughs> Yeah. It's such a good photo place with the light and everything. Yes. Okay. Come in here. Um, gloves, so you don't have to, and I'll leave. So you're just going to apply the numbing cream just to your face, just as a good lotion. It looks like perm. It looks like relaxer. Yes. There's two hand pieces. There's Clear and Brilliant Original or Clear and Brilliant Permea. And one is more targeted toward texture and the other one toward tone. So my issue mostly is um, like color. So is that tone? Like my neck is a total different color than my, than my face? Yeah, so Permea can help um, even out hyperpigmentation. That's the word, yes. So we can go ahead and start with that treatment first. Okay. Because I mean, recently I did start seeing some texture issues just in certain spots. Mm -hmm. I'm sure you could probably tell too. The but, treatments are both wonderful, but we can start off with the Permea handpiece today. I really don't have like texture issues, 
like here I do right here it's just tone like you see my neck and face is a different color yeah so I need to be one color <laughs> look it's not even my hand color like can I be my hand color? can I be my body's color so that's what I'm here for I'm not trying to bleach or anything like that a lot of people especially African Americans love to berate other African Americans for getting skin treatments and brightening their skin this is not to look light skin. This is to look like my skin, okay? Like my natural born color. I'll show you guys a baby picture if I need to because I was not this color in the face. But I've had a lot of skin burn, sunburn, and skin burns. And I did not know that black people were supposed to wear sunscreen. I did not know that until like last year. Yeah, so. Mm. That's what it feels like. Okay, it's not bad. I can feel, it's like a little pinch, kind of. Yeah, it's kind of like a static pinch. Okay. Okay, may I keep going? Yes. Okay, ready? Mm-hmm. this is a mask so she said that it's not it may or may not get that main scar but then I could always go to a dermatologist with a deeper type of um, laser after I see them for the six treatments so we'll see how this works it might actually kind of clear it so now I'm gonna go shopping uh, pretty good okay. Hit me, girl, in this Lexus. I want some money, sis. I'm suing. Like, if you want. I'm gonna take a walk. Girl, not today. But it got cute. You're kidding me. Like, what is this? Get the heck out of here. Ew. So, so there's a whole line at Zara. Baby, I'm not about to wait for no. That bus almost killed me. Girl, I'm just not about to wait in line and hopefully it's not as congested because I really came here for Zara, low key. So I'm about to go to Neiman Marcus since it's right across the street and then go back to Zara. This is such a cute outfit. I like that anyway. Yeah, I want that one then. Waterproof. Waterproof? Yeah, totally. And then, the, what, do you know where the Baccarat is? Yeah. Fragrance? I can, I can take it here too. Okay, sure. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, now, it's the choice between this and this. Oh. Uh, the, the original one. That's the one I want. Well, tell me the difference just in case. Though. Well, actually, they are different. This one has a few more flowers in it, different so, notes, but they're very similar. So let more me have floral. You. And so the other one I know is unisex. Uh, just to let you know, there's no trying to close inside the store. Oh. Yeah, yeah. It hurt my feelings. was a complete bust they did not have the whole brand in there and so i'm about to head to nordstrom because they, they have the brand that i want i got a bunch of stuff Oh, 
I'm so sorry. They actually look like it fits quite right, huh? They do. It's just I'm scared. They're slippery. Like, is that a thing or? Oh, that's because it has the leather bottom. But just okay, walk okay. on the hard. Floor yeah, that makes sense. Because it won't like like the that's how we put it on the carpet. Okay, okay, gotcha. Like a little. Okay. They look hot. I like them too. So I'm getting the Ugg. If I'm getting the shoes, he's gonna order these because I will never be able to find these. These are kind of slippery. They have leather bottom. So how exclusive. Throwing a hundred, I think, 118, something like that. And I got the Uggs. I'm trying on these Uggs. I didn't know that they sized down, so I like these. These are the only colors black. I would only wear black because I hate this color. I don't know why I hate these, but I just do. Okay. So I'm trying to get this Armani mascara and it is sold out everywhere it's sold out at Neiman Marcus and I think they don't have it here either in the waterproof so I'm gonna have to maybe order it online because it's the eyes to kill our money is that it yes yay okay okay we just had like a big sale yeah okay I know I missed it yesterday or okay just this area here that's I guess doing what it needs to do and then this side so this is where I tried to shave like weeks ago and I got I guess bumps it just it did not work I never need to shave my face again yeah don't do that stuff so um, I guess my skin is purging a little but it is very glowy it's like really glowy so I'm gonna go to sleep and let all of this do what it needs to do. And yeah. Okay, so my skin looks much better. Looks a little lighter. Um, the bumps are basically going away. This one and this one. Yesterday, the swelling is gone. It's not as textured either. Just a little texture there. But I'm looking better. So I think, you know, I see a little subtle change. But I'm gonna keep going back. I have to go back in the in a few weeks. So yeah. So I'm gonna get ready and get my life together and move on to the next portion of the vlog. So I am back to unbox everything that I hauled in Chicago while shopping. I got the laser away. Thank you bag. They gave me a mask to wear. So I got these as well, but these are actually shades. This is the box packaging, whatever comes in. And I saw these originally on Evelyn Lozada. You know, she's just a fashionable chick. Her and Jennifer are the best, especially Jennifer. She's like the best dressed on Basketball Wives. And so I ended up seeing them at the beauty supply store for like $6. And I was like, yes, the dupes. They were so nice. But guess what? They broke. I bought three pairs. The first pair broke. I went back and bought two pairs. Well, I lost one or somebody stole them. And then I broke the last one. So I said, you know what? I'm tired of these cheap glasses. I'm going to get the real. Yeah. Anyway, these were, are much more sturdier. Much more sturdier than the cheap ones. I'm going to be honest with you. So I'm scared to break these, but I don't think that I will. But these are icy, baby. It even has the YSL in the nose part. And I'm like, dang. Because that's where the makeup goes. The makeup residue. So I'm going to have to get some tape and just tape it on there so that it will forever be clean. But these are icy. Yeah. I see why it's so shades. Come on. I can't quote my biggie line, the I'm clocking your Versace shade washing you, because these aren't Versace. I should have said it in my other video. These are worth it, because I'm going to keep these for 500 years if I can, you know, pass them down to my children. Okay. Is I was supposed to get two pairs of shoes, but they didn't have my size in the shoots. They're so cute. And they told me that they were better than the Steve Madden versions that I was trying to get, which are actually the dupes for the Louboutins because I don't want any un more uncomfortable shoes so I I'm definitely going to get either the um I'm gonna get the shoes but I got a pair of Uggs from Nordstrom they're everywhere they're actually at Nordstrom rack for 119 I had to get these for 169 
and I started to take them back, but I was like, well, they don't even have my size, so I was like, dang, I missed out on $60. They only have, like, sizes 5, and I think 10, and I think 6, or something like that. You small feet girls have the best of luck. They're even at Walmart for $74 in a size 5 or 6. So, I feel like everyone and their mother wears a size 8 or 8.5. Even 9s. So, it is what it is. So I also got the Giorgio Armani Mascara. This is the Eyes to Kill in the Waterproof. So I originally stopped at Neiman Marcus to get this because I saw the lady in the shoe department where I was trying to buy the shoes from. She, her eyes were just so pretty and I was like, ma'am, I thought she was going to like color profile me, but she didn't. She just, you know, asked me for assistance and so I was like, you're your lashes are amazing. Would you mind please telling me what lashes you're wearing? Well, not lashes. I knew that they were her real lashes. But what mascara you're wearing? And she's like, oh, this is the uh, Armani. And that's all she said. So I didn't want to be, this is the packaging. Packaging, it's actually kind of underwhelming. But it was only like $30, 36 something like that. Not even 36 like 32 And I think I got it on sale for like 27 So I ended up still paying with tax like 30 31 But she she didn't say which one, but I didn't want to be thirsty, you know, and just, you know, ask her which one. So I assumed it was the latest one with the... It's the only one that they're selling right now that has um, longevity, not longevity, length to it. My favorite is the drugstore forever. It is the L'Oreal Telescopic and then now the Essence. It's like $5, the Extreme Lash. It's amazing. The MAC Extreme Lash is amazing as well. It's $25, but it's the same as the Telescopic, so you might as well get that. But I had to get this one because her, her eyes just look really good. So I do... Okay, so one of my realtors in New York... She, when I was uh, living there and I was trying to move to Queens, her lashes were amazing. So I asked her and she said she was wearing Lancome Grandiose Extreme. When I tell you I drove all the way out to Jamaica, Queens, to Rigo Park Mall, to Ulta and got it, it was like 36, 37, but you know, it was worth it. And I still have it and it's been three years and that mascara is amazing. So I think those two are gonna be really comparable. So anyway, moving on, the Maison Francis from Neiman Marcus. So it was on sale for like two something. I think it was like 25% off. And when I got to Chicago, something told me to buy it the night before. But I said, no, nah, I'm gonna wait till I get to Chicago. I'm gonna wait till I get to Chicago. I was salty. One of my cousins worked for, you know, Lord and Taylor and you know, just, uh, he loved, he's like the Metro kind of guy. So he always has amazing fragrances. He put me on the Dolce & Gabbana. Um, the polo, I think like, not light blue, it's like a polo fragrance, but definitely the Burberry back in 2001. So I had my dad to go get it and it's, it reminds me of the Maison Francis. Same color of, um, fra uh, the, the cologne or the fragrance or whatever, perfume. This is the Eau de Parfum. Eau de Parfum. That, and I did find the dupe for this. It's the Ariana Grande Cloud. It is definitely a dupe. The way that it dries down, it's definitely a dupe. However, it's not as it's not as potent on your skin, and it doesn't linger as long. That's the only thing. It lingers on surfaces, but not necessarily your skin. And that's what I'm looking for, like the skin. So I know that I unboxed the Opium boots, but I had to get the Opium heels. So these are not the sandals. Obviously, these are the actual. This is the pump. I wanted to get the the heel pump because. I can wear it year long, all year long without, you know, up north it's cold. You know, I can wear these all year long versus the sandals just in the summer. So I love this YSL detail. They're just fabulous shoes. I got these in a size 40. Wait. It's, it's kind of, I, I wanted them to be leather, but I was like, well, it is what it is. I already have the Pagals, but the Pagals look differently than these. They have the red bottom, so I wouldn't always wear these out as much as I would with the Pagals. So, it is what it is. Next is Zara. I'm going to show you guys what I got from Zara, and I'm going to get off this vlog. Because I know some of you probably don't like me No, Y'all probably like, what's she got going on? But no, I just tried to vlog to give you guys some different content. And so, let's try on some of this stuff. But I just got some bodysuits from Zara. Just simple. I thought at first this was going to be deep cut. You know, I didn't want to, you know, the Saints can't just have our breast all the way out here like that. But, you know, I like to give a little cleave every now and then. Just a little piece. I don't have much to cleave anyway, girl. I'm, you know, in the A ministry, in the A cup ministry. Am I an A or B? I think I'm a B cup. So I'm in the B cup ministry. Praise God. 
we've grown, okay? New levels, okay? Um, so yeah, I love this color. It's like a nice maroon, maroonish color. So I thought that'd be cute with some cute little leather skirts or something. So I got this cute little dress, this ruched dress on the side. It's just uh, a rib knit dress with the, um, you know, the mock neck or whatever they call that these days. And the side is ruched. I thought there would be a split on the side, but there's really not. So I got the same bodysuit in brown chocolate because y'all know I love me chocolate theme. I'm going to try to do the Instagram theme as well. That's why I got these because I'm trying to, you know, secure the bag. So I saw these sweats in a lot of other people's hauls and I said, let me get these. I saw these on the site and that's why I go to the hauls to see if they fit. But let me tell you, the sets do not match in the brown color. If you saw during the vlog, no, they did not match. So I just got the bottoms and then I, I'll just put it with the white tops from Zara. I already have a bunch of sweaters and tops from Zara. I love the fact that they have pockets and they're just basic sweats. Honestly, these are at Walmart in the boys section. They just probably don't have brown. Another shirt, turtleneck shirt for my videos because I could never have too many black tops. Another shirt, I got it in blue. I don't, not blue, it's like a purple. I think this is purple. Is this like a, it's like a purplish blue. This color is tricky because it's like you can get away with so many things, but it's like, I don't know. I would just be safe and wear this with a gray or khaki. Then I got it in white. I'm a repeat offender. If I see one thing that's cute, I'm going to get it in all three colors or four, five, six, 17 colors. So yeah, this is the same rib knit. It's a nice detail. Oh girl, it's dirty. Which am I going to have to go back to Chicago? Why would you put your hands on something? And then all the associates in there, Girl, is this white or cream? Because I would hate to bleach it. I'm upset. I want to tell my mama. So I got the Amber Fusion exclusive collection. Oh, it smells good. It's sophisticated. Very. Oh, this is Grown Lady. This reminds me of a mixture of It was giving me like euphoria type. Mmm, opium. Like the original YSL opium mixed with black opium, which is a little sweeter. Uh, there's definitely amber. I can smell some vanilla, which saves the day for me. Now, I like this. This is a sophisticated scent. Totally, and it was only $15. This is it, and it's potent. I can still smell it. Like, it, it's it's in the atmosphere. This is a go. So, that's all that I got for now. I'm gonna do my Zara haul full of all four bags that I got from Zara Chicago before, and you'll see the fashion hauls coming. But thank you guys for watching, and thumbs up this video if you like to see more vlogs, behind the scenes type of, you know, content of the life of an influencer. And I appreciate you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.